The irony is, the advertising industry knows everyone hates what they produce. This is why they keep looking for new ways to force people to stay tuned. Most years, if you were to ask me how much I make, the genuine answer is that I have no clue. I usually find out the answer to that question once a year, at tax time, when my accountant tells me. To operate based on conviction and belief requires an acceptance that your actions could get you fired. This is different from pig-headed bravado, and it is different from putting the company at risk. Pilots have their names painted just beneath the canopy of their aircraft. This gives the pilot a sense of ownership for his or her jet. What's more, like cars, each aircraft has its own personality, so it's important for a pilot to get to know and love his aircraft. Never opt for change simply to leave something you don't like. Change works best when you go towards something, even if it is the unknown. Leadership is the ability to rally people not for a single event, but for years. The value we provide most to others is the same value we appreciate most from others. Average companies give their people something to work on. The most innovative organizations give their people something to work toward. I'm very prescriptive about who I work with. I'm very clear about what I believe. If they believe what I believe I will work with them. If they say things like, convince me we should do this. I walk away. There are two types of claims, those based on hard numbers and those based on slippery numbers. Entrepreneurs must be practical experts. They needn't set out to be subject matter experts in what they do, they must set out to solve a problem or pursue some cause or purpose greater than themselves. Sometimes spending time with someone who is perceived as successful can make us feel less successful. We should always choose to work with people we love. They are the ones who will watch our back and our future. Though there are lessons that can be learned about becoming a great leader, most exist inherently in the bellies of those who lead. The why exists in the part of the brain that controls feelings and decision-making but not language. What's exist in the part of the brain that controls rational thought and language? I never imagined working with CEOs, congressmen or the military, yet I make regular visits to the Pentagon, stop by the Capitol now and then and sit down with leaders of all kinds of companies. Passion alone can't cut it. For passion to survive it needs structure. A why without how has little probability of success. For the feeling of trust to develop, we have to feel safe expressing ourselves first. We have to feel safe being vulnerable. The true value of an organization is measured by the desire others have to contribute to that organization's ability to keep succeeding, not just during the time they are there, but well beyond their own tenure. The role of a leader is not to come up with all the great ideas. The role of a leader is to create an environment in which great ideas can happen.